Hi, pretty soon I'll be leaving Aussie again and heading off to the USA for our next lot of commercial and small farm training. We're holding that this time at Pascadero in California, a beautiful location in amongst the redwoods. And uh, we're going to the Ouroboros farm there to do the practical side of the training. And we'll be doing all the lectures themselves at the beautiful Still Heart Institute. It's just a wonderful place, first class actually, a uh, lovely place to stay and be. So we're going over there and we're going to train you in how to run a commercial and small farm. Really good stuff. We've got top trainers from all around America. We've got Jesse and Molly who will teach you about all sorts of things. Molly actually does some fantastic photography of insects, beneficial insects as well as ones that eat your plants. She's got a great deal of knowledge on how to do that. Jesse, he's actually been involved in a lot of cold weather aquaponics. Aquaponics right up in Milwaukee and places like that in the USA. So he's got a lot of experience in that area. Myself, I'll be there, and as you know, I've travelled all over the world and seen lots of farms and done lots of things in this regard. We'll also have a guy called Cosmo, who has just got a wealth of experience. Actually, he traces right back in aquaponics. You know, I always find a bit humorous. You see people on websites, they start their website up. There's one I'm thinking of in particular. Started his website up only three years ago, and when he put it up, he claimed he had 10 years experience. You look at his website now, he's got 45 years of experience. Amazing. But Cosmo is one of the guys that can really trace his history back. He was working at the New Alchemy Institute as an apprentice way back in the 60s. Now that's a guy that's done a lot of aquaponics. And he can tell you some really interesting stuff about the history of aquaponics and how it works. Now interestingly, he's got a lot of experience with geodesic domes. Now we haven't advertised this yet, but we're going to be having a whole segment on geodesic domes at our training seminar. Um, we're actually going to have a guy there to build a small one to show you how to do it. It's just going to be fantastic. I think they're a great thing. They're a wonderful thing too in cold weather climates in particular because of the strength they have. They can take a big snow load. But anyway, I better not tell you too much. That's what's going to be there. Now that's just part of it. Now we've already put some video clips up before of the Ouroboros teams, the girls at Ouroboros and the guys there who are actually working on the farm, building this farm up, getting it running. Uh, you'll see that if you look dig down through my video clips. So, what a great team. I've just got to emphasise to you, we're not just a place that's doing training that's just got one farm. We've had one farm, so now we're an expert. No, we've got multiple facets of experience in all kinds of things with aquaponics across time zones and temperature zones, climate zones. We can cover the lot and show you how to do it. Meet me there. Look at my website aquaponics.net.au aquaponics.net.au and follow the links to the training you'll see it there right on the front page the other access to my website is through practical aquaponics one word dot com practical aquaponics dot com you can see my website there there's also another access that you can get to and that is just dial in aquaponics institute dot com that's aquaponics institute one word dot com and you'll see details there about our training as well. Now there's only about four weeks to go. It's at the end of February this year, 2013. So if you want to come, shake a leg, get on with it, book your place, because if you don't, you might miss out. Particularly if you want to stay at the beautiful Still Heart. Now we've done a great deal there on accommodation. And you should just look at that, look that website up. You'll see links on my site to it, but it's stillheartinstitute.com. It is actually five-star accommodation. It's just absolutely beautiful. We did a great deal on the accommodation, but we've only got about 100 and... Well, I'm not sure. I won't say how many. We've only got a, a, a limited number of spots, so those that book early will get to stay at the beautiful Still Heart. Now, there's another benefit in that that you're going to get if you stay at the beautiful Still Heart, and that is the meeting after the meeting, as they call it. Once we've finished our training in the evening and we have dinner, then we'll be sitting around at night having a chat, and that's the time you'll get to question ask all those questions you've got to me, to the other trainers, and you know another fascinating thing about this is the networking opportunities. We find the people that come to our training are pretty smart people a lot of them, and they've got a lot of experience as well. They've got things they can share with you. So the opportunity in this training for some really remarkable learning, it's unique. So make sure you're there. Once again my website aquaponics.net.au or practicalaquaponics.com or aquaponicsinstitute.com. Pretty easy. Look it up. Make sure you get there. See ya.